Stevenson falls to Messiah tonight, 3-0. Glenn Clark with head coach Toddy Corba. Coach, obviously you were up against, uh, you know, really tough competition tonight and one of the best teams in the country. Knowing that, and knowing you still clearly wanted to get a result anyway, what did you make of your team's effort tonight? A great effort. Um, we, you know, had a pretty specific game plan that we, you know, had to put in place, uh, you know, not much time between games. So, you know, not a, a ton of time to work on it, two days, really. And, um, you know, I think our biggest concern was them kind of staying committed to that plan, staying disciplined, um, more mentally kind of checked in and disciplined than anything. And, and I thought they did a great job, um, you know, kind of sticking to the game plan and, um, you know, following through on the things that we asked them to do. You had some chances to equalize there in the second half, and, and, and who knows what happens from there. But is that sort of what you're reflecting on, that you look back on that and say, boy, th you know, you, you say you're going to have that chance in the second half to equalize against Messiah. you got to be pretty happy about that. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, for sure it could have been, you know, 1-1. Um, and, I, and I think that, um, you know, it was, it was a great game, I think, for our very young squad to see that, um, you know, while Messiah is the defending national champions, one of the best in the country, it's a team that, you know, when we play them the right way, um, you know, and, and maybe low press and then look to break out, it's something that, you know, we can, um, you know, uh, bottom line is we want to play them again. Yep. So that's that's kind of the goal. Got to work to that opportunity the next couple of weeks. Uh, at the end of the match, uh, a fifth save for Keegan. So she finishes with five, and she's now tied with Tiffany all time for the most saves in Stevenson history. Correct me if I'm wrong, you had one year with Tiffany, correct, at the end of her career? Yeah. In what ways are the two, since they're standing together at the moment, in what ways are the two similar, obviously the two greatest goalies in Stevenson history? Yeah, you know, I think just that um, competitive mindset, I think first and foremost, and I know, um, you know, Tiff had a great career, and I know that she, you know, she worked hard to improve every single year and, and you know, really didn't rest. And um, Keegan has absolutely done the same thing and, um, you know, continues to find the things that she needs to improve and, and work to make them better. And, um, you know, she's just been kind of the anchor for us for so long and um, has been, you know, five years I've been here five years with uh, Keegan, so I have to get her on staff, maybe <laughs> uh, find a way to keep her around. But, um, yeah, you know, we're looking forward to her breaking that record. I think it's very well deserved. So we'll have to tune in for that on Saturday, obviously. But then what do you need to do? The obvious, as you point out, wanting to get another shot at him, you got to keep getting points. You're going to need three points to make sure you put yourself in that position. What's going to have to happen on Saturday against Alverney to bounce back and get three? Yeah, you know, our next three games, um, we feel like they're all must-win games. And, you know, I think we um, need to feel like our backs are up against the wall. And if we want to stay in control of things, you know, and not be dependent on other results, then we need to come away with, um, you know, three wins over the next three games. All right, we'll see you on Saturday. Coach, appreciate you taking the time. Thank you. She's Toddy Corba. I'm Glenn Clark. GoMustangSports.com.